Hi again, everyone. We are reading uh, devotions for young children called Popcorn Clouds and Bubblegum Trees. And the author is Susan Damon. And she has written 26 devotions for us to share together, one for each letter of the alphabet. Yesterday, we learned about A is for alligator and how God makes lots of alligators, but no two alligators are the same, just like you and me. We're humans, but we are not the same. We're so different, and God delights in our differences. So today we're on the letter B. B is for bubblegum. Okay. Have you ever heard of Betty Bubbles? Why, she can chew the very same piece of bubble gum for days and days and days. At mealtime, Betty parks her gum behind her ear or on the edge of her plate. At bedtime, she places it carefully on her dresser, ready to be chewed first thing the next morning. Because Betty keeps adding fresh pieces, the wad of gum grows bigger and bigger and bigger. But finally, a sad day comes when Betty's precious gum gets tangled in her hair or rolls underneath the dusty couch, or worse, her teacher notices Betty chewing and Betty loses both her gum and her recess. From years of chewing, Betty Bubbles has learned something important about bubble gum. At first, it tastes great, but after a little while, it tastes kind of stale and yucky. That's why Betty has to keep adding new pieces of bubble gum. Lots of things in life are like bubble gum. New toys, new pets, new games, and new clothes are very exciting. But after a while, we get tired of them. They get boring. Then we want something else new. Hey, but what about God? Does God ever get boring? Is God like bubble gum? Nope. Never, because every day God has something new to show us, something exciting to teach us. In God's world, there's so much to learn. Maybe today or tomorrow you'll look closely at a strange bug or a spider's web or a dandelion or a snowflake. <clears throat> Maybe you'll see a giant oak tree or watch a noisy thunderstorm. Maybe you'll find a new hiding place or a new book or a new friend. God has filled our world with new and interesting things. Life with God can be fresh and flavorful, not like old bubble gum. We can go to bed at night happy and content, and we can wake up in the morning eager to see what God has in store for us, what new things God is waiting to show us. Well, let's have a little praise time because God is so good. The book of Psalms is full of uh, verses that are praiseworthy. This is Psalm 92, verse 4. If you want to look that up, you can read along with me. Uh, Lord, you have made me happy by what you have done. I will sing for joy about what your hands have done. Let's read that again. Lord, you have made me happy by what you have done. I will sing for joy about what your hands have done. Let's pray. God, life with you is an adventure. We thank you and we praise you. In Jesus' name, amen. And remember, I love you. But as we're going through this ABC devotional, we're seeing how much more God loves you than me. So have sweet dreams. Bye-bye.